Well, hi, Tech Nomad here for another two minute tech talk. Today, we're gonna to talk about these cable keepers. If you have a lot of cables, you may have tried this tape. That's not gonna work because it doesn't always stay on and then you have to take it off every time you wanna do a new cable so that thing doesn't fit. The next one a lot of people try is using the twisty wire tie. And th while that does give you some advantages because I can make it very big or very small and I can take it off when I need to, it only holds right at that point. So it really doesn't hold, doesn't help me with the cable. So that's up. Next thing was split tubing, which makes it look nice and pretty. It looks like something out of a science fiction show. I like this, but the problem is that I have to have all of these different sizes. While this one looks fine with these two wires, if I had four more wires, I can't use this one. It's all bunging out. And then to keep it together, I usually have to put ties on. And so that doesn't work. So we, so that thing doesn't work. The next one that a lot of people try to do is they try to use wire ties. And the problem with the wire ties is, is that when I want to add another wire, I have to cut off the wire tie and that doesn't do me any good. Plus you usually have to put one like every so often. All right, so what is the answer you ask? The answer is these little things that I found on the internet and they're absolutely fantastic. It is so simple, so easy, yet it works just fine. It's basically, it's a piece of neoprene cloth with a zipper. What happens is, is that you put it together. That's the tough part. Can you put it together? I can't do a zipper. That's why all my stuff is Velcro. You zip it up, now you have a nice tubing. It's not just that it's a nice tubing. Keeps the wires there. Is it super long? No. These are only about a foot, so you might need a couple of these if you have a really, really long run. But there's some things you can do with this that you can't do with anything else. The first thing I like is, is that if I need to add a wire, it's as simple as unzipping it, putting the wire in, and then zipping it back up. Tubing, trying to take that off is a nightmare. It's twisting, it's fighting with you. Because it's neoprene and because it's flexible, See, I end up with a lot of things like this where it might be a very long wire. What I really want to do is I want to make this shorter. So what I end up doing is I have a bunch of wire like this. Now, I got a problem. What am I going to do with this? Well, on that split tubing, there's nothing I can do. I'm stuck with it. But with this, with the neoprene, because it stretches, boys and girls, I can just take this, feed it in there. I'm, gonna, I'm trying to do this in real time with only one hand, uh, with two hands. Come on, make me look good. There we go. See, I can shove that in there. No big deal. You can't do that with the split tubing. You can't do that with anything else. I can actually put that in there, not have to worry about it. And if I needed to pull it out, I can pull some out. I can adjust it. What if I have a real lot of wires, which I sometimes do. This is just a few wires. Well, I found I can take two of them and put them together. So I just zip the end from one to the end of the other. Now I have, what, a two inch, two, three inch hole. Plus, remember now we said that this is stretchy so I can really jam a lot of wires in there. So these things are just absolutely fantastic. I'll put a link below. If you like little tech tips like this, please hit the subscribe button. If you want longer, more detailed reviews, please check out our main channel, which is the High Tech Nomad. Until the next time, this is Orman Beckles, AKA the High Tech Nomad, signing out.